Oh my god, right. Morning ladies and gentlemen, hope you're all well and as you just see we've done a timber raid. Timber, the new Gen 5. The new Gen 5 wave has come out, went out live last night for us. Uh, I didn't record, I was busy watching films. But anyway, we got this. This is the priority, this is the one to get because, wow it's weather boost as well, nice. Uh, a silver pine out that bad boy. Um, I'm going to go through some of the details of which Pokemon are spawning, which are in eggs, which are now in raids. This is the only one available in raids. One star. I think it will stay put in one star. <sighs> Chucking a little log. There we go. If we can pine up that, that will play in our favour very nicely because there is a new feature that also went live, which means a few Pokemon, I think nine or ten Pokemon, where the middle stage, um, if the Pokemon has been traded, my time of my buddy interaction, Machop and Machoke, if you trade them and then evolve them and want to evolve them over to Machamp, it doesn't cost any candy now. So that's a perk if, for example, you're lacking in Machamps or I think Golem's in there, and certainly Con Kelder or Timber, as this one is, is in that list. So that's going to save you a buttload of candy, but there we go. Dexted. Fantastic. Nine away. I have no idea if this is good or not. 89. 10 attack. Doesn't matter though, because I have a lucky trade with my spare account, which I may use on this for the purpose of this video to see. But you see, the first evolve stage is 50 candy, and then it takes apparently 200 candy to evolve over to Conkelda from Gudur, or whatever it's called. So that's where the trading comes into play very nicely. Right, there's a party hat wor- not party hat Wurmple, I wish there was a party hat Wurmple nearby. There's a party hat Wobbuffet or two uh, in the near distance, which we're going to go and do. But before we do that, it'll probably be in tomorrow's video. Um, from this graphic, you can see that Kadabra, Machoke, Graveler, both forms, Haunter, Baldor, which is a new, Gerda, which is new, and Carablast, and Shelmet, all of those are new. So there are four new, four old, which, if you trade them, they have no candy cost to evolve, which is fantastic. We're doing a trade or two to try and get some decent IV ones of Gerda, or try and get some good Conkelder, because Conkelder is now the best overall fighting type. It's not as good DPS as Lucario, due to Aurosphere, but it's better than the Machamp, at long last, after nearly four years, three and a half years of the game, <laughs> we finally got a better fighting type than Machamp overall. So there are some new ones spawning in the world. None of them are amazing as far as I'm concerned. So you've got, I can't pronounce these names, you've got Timple, which I managed to get last night. Um, that's probably the, the most common one. Uh, Dweeble, Dwebble, Trubbish we got, uh, Carablast, Joltic, which well, Joltic's a little cute electric spy, which I quite like. That's funky. Shelmet and Rog Rogna Roller or something. We've got some new regionals. Saw is the regional for Europe uh, and a few other places. I managed to get one last night as well. There was a small cock up with Faraw or whatever it was that's supposed to be in America, but it was spawning here in the UK for sure. So there's a new regional for Egypt and Greece, which is the kind of Egyptian looking Pokemon. I can't remember what it's called. Skulf or something. I, I don't know. And there's a western and eastern fish, whatever it's called, blue striped and red striped basilin or something like that. And there are new Pokemon and eggs as well, which is cool. Some of these new Pokemon are sadly egg only. Uh, Axew, for example, is a 10k hatch only. Tiuga and Archen. 10k egg only. The only other one, Timber, as you just saw, was in raids. They're not spawning in the wild as far as I'm aware, which I think is a bit BS and I can take for it personally. Make them spawn in the wild even if they're rare. Found the quiet spot. Right. Yeah, so that's a little tiny video to sort of keep you updated with the new Gen 5 Pokemon, which ones are now out, which ones are sadly only available in eggs, uh, which ones you can get in raids. So go for Timber in level 1 raids, try and get a few luckies if you can. Make sure you trade them because having to not pay 200 candies to evolve one is frankly fantastic. It's certainly going to save time on 
you know, getting a squad of them. So with that, thank you very much for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you are new with the notification bell hit. Throw a like on the video if you enjoyed it. And take care, everybody. And we'll see if we get a shiny with this in the next video. <laughs>